And here we have it, the Ong Onga, which as you can see is a lot smaller. But nevertheless, do not underestimate its danger. And its awesomeness. So as you can see, if we get down here, I believe it is currently flowering. Maybe it's not, maybe that's just another, I think that's just another plant growing by. Nah, I don't think that's just flowers. Silly me, I don't want to mislead you viewers. So anyway, that's an onga onga. Amazing, dramatic and wonderful. And um, well, as you see, a lot of the vegetation along here has been cut back quite a lot. Obviously to keep this fence clear and free of anything that might compromise its efficacy and safety of the wildlife in the valley below. And um, yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoyed this. Oops, where's the fantail? Ah, there's the fantail up here, I think. Hello? Fluttering around. Little visitor. And um, probably really should not be sitting down by a very lethal piece of vegetation. Anyway, thank you for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And um, this is me, Gardener Gone Wild, having a bit of a selfie with an onga onga. Shows you how wild a gardener I am. Yes, everyone's favourite gardening, botany and outdoor wild adventures channel. Thank you for watching. And yet again, it's hard not to fully appreciate this onga onga. Oh, onga onga onga. Just, just look at those spines. I mean, those noxious spines. Believe the extract of five of them is enough to kill a guinea pig, or three. Depends on what your sources are. Obviously, I don't like killing animals. Definitely don't like killing guinea pigs. Um, but I'm fully, fully approval with trapping here. It's cool, like you know, all these critters that can be and survive and all of that good stuff. I mean, seeing saddlebacks earlier in the lower valley was pretty impressive, for sure. I just love this onga onga. Just love the onga onga here. First ever onga onga I saw was this onga onga here. And um, but I've seen a fair few, you know, since. Well, not a fair few, but a few. I still love coming back to this very same onga onga which is um, in between the two entrances of the turbine track here at Zealandia. So um, it's closer obviously to this entrance, which is here. Ong Ong is obviously just literally just above it. And that was where the wind turbine was. So yes, that's what we like. And hopefully this camera battery will last long enough for some more footage. Which you probably would have actually seen before this ending, maybe. Unless, of course, it's not actually the ending. Who knows? Gardener Gone Wild, the mysterious channel that no one knows what is going on. And I just love this archway of Kawakawa. I mean, just look at that. So pretty. Just want to go inside it. Whee! And here we are on the turbine track. Doo -doo 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 -doo.